So how is Chuck... Oh, whoops, that's not what I meant to do. Status. I want to get Chuck more attack, which is why I have him with the sword medium. Better check before we get lost. Okay, right there. Yeah, it sort of is it. Because there's really no way. I, I kind of hope and wish that stations were like, hey, you can go to any station from any station. Not really sure if that's how it's going to work, but I hope that's how it works. That would be the good way to do it. Maybe later in the game we'll get something akin to an airship. Is this... No, just Sniper and Fan. <laughs> Sniper and Dead, it's gotta be a lie. There's no way he could have died. I mean, we're talking about the strongest, coolest, most amusing of heroes. One and only Nightburn. You're a fool. He's gotta be alive somewhere, I'm sure of it. I know you, like... I know Nightburn tries to hide it, but still. It makes me sick. Let me just say this. I'll never believe those silly rumors about Nightburn being a villain. <laughs> or any such nonsense like that. Dumb idiot. Oh, Kanon. Hey, I didn't think you were here. Right now, Nine of the Soul Nigers on Phil Guy have been freed. There are 16 left to purify. There are 16 Soul Nigers? That's more than half of the Soul Nigers. I wonder if that means anything on, like, how close we are to being done with the game. They say that the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Now is the time for you to... Yeah. Only... Only seven more Soul Nigers to go. Human psychology is such a delightful thing, don't you agree? Betrayed by the man they adored as a hero. It turned right around, curse him, their words full of scorn. So there can't be Soul Nigers on the map then, because... If there's a Soul Niger for every dungeon, that's that means there's only seven dungeons left in the game. Others hold on to their self-made image of the hero, believing it all must be some kind of mistake. Which side holds the truth, or could it be that neither has the full story? Okay, I'm looking for a cameo. I don't think there's a- WAIT! Brad from Wild Arms 2. The rugged trained workman. This is clearly Brad. Have you encountered the puzzle boxes? They're strange structures dotted here and across the world map. Some unknown architect took the problems devised by a puzzle aficionado and brought them to life within a mysterious alternate dimension. Oh no! Oh no! The Millennium Puzzles are back! If you run into one of your one in your travels, I think it'd be well worth your time to try it out. I'm sure, I'm sure whoever made them would love to see his creations tested by anyone who thinks they might be smart. Eh, Millennium Puzzles are back! Hey, can I go? Yo, we can go anywhere! Take me to Cobham Valley. Let's go visit Capo Bronco. Alright. Back to the field. I want to see something really quick. Oh, dude, we haven't been here in so long. I just want to take a little gander at the world map because we have the mono wheel now. Um, not the first region, right? This is the second region, I think. Don't miss anything. Just take a look around. Don't miss anything. Ba, 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 bum, bum. Let's take a good look around. Searching. 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 Let's look at the map. Just take a look around. 
Let's take a good look around. Just take 69. A look around. I saw 69 there for a second. On the latitude longitude. Okay, you know what? Take me back to the station. This was a mistake. This will be a lot of the post game, probably. I'll try to get a list of all the treasures, and we'll do that. Or maybe I'll do it some in the main game, but that'll be a mostly a post game thing. Hey, Rudy, how's it going? I hear that the mine they're digging over in Mirapulse is the site of a great battle from 12,000 years ago. Apparently, there's still remains there. From the fight, the golems fighting each other, taking and retaking each other's fortresses. What do you think about that? Waging war by moving little pegs around with no bloodshed on either end? Me, I think golems have feelings too. Ah, where have I heard that before? It's almost like that's a Wild Arms 1 message. Okay, which one is the station I need? Oh, Prevectus is a, it's a region, that's why. Is it Alcedonia? Jet, you're here now. No, I want. I want to talk to Jet. I just want to talk to Jet. On these days, a pretty active farming village. I heard they cultivate some rare crops over there, so I went ahead and paid the place a visit. But didn't have any canned fruits I was hoping for. Instead, they all they have was unlucky twin monster eggs. Man, I just wish I could eat that golem fruit one more time. All drowned in sweet syrup and everything. So that's why I'm in 12-bit, what with all the rich folks living in the town. Someone has to have them in stock somewhere. First thing to do, though, is to go to work and rack up enough money. When I find my can of peaches, I better be able to afford it. Yeah, Jet is obsessed with money. Um, so I assume now we can't do the Humpty Dumpty quest. I already did it, but I'm assuming that's the cutoff. I finally finished up the apprentice mission the guild sent me. I thought I'd pay a visit to 12-bit along the way. It's a pretty nice town, isn't it? It was built just as the Phil Guy Express opened up, so it's fairly new city by city standards today. Oh, this place. I wonder where we are in here. This is the same. Oh, this is the same we region as Capo Bronco. Interesting. I didn't think this was the same region as Capo Bronco. To be honest. See anything? See anything? I'm gonna do a few fights. Oh, hello. Duplicator chest. Mine. Five Gela cards. Let's take a good look around. I wanna see if the enemies are too weak. If they are, then I'll just like save my time. See anything? Dude, so like. Let's take a good look around. I don't know. I feel like we might actually be close closer to finishing the game than I thought, especially if there's only seven Soul Nikers left. Still not gonna finish before Dragon Quest Monsters, but around. we'll be, or we're probably like take a pretty look close, see. relatively close. We'll see, see what happens. Anything? I think we'll definitely finish the game in December though. Just before the Stay new up. year hits. You guys are new, I think. Uh, shoot this one. Shoot this Manta. Ow. That hurt a lot. Who am I going to kill here? Yeah, there's two of them there. Um, Prepare yourself. Prepare yourself. Rebecca, you and me. Huh? But yeah, the Soul Niger thing has me curious. Because if there are, like, 
if there aren't just like seven more dungeons in the game, that means that some dungeons are not gonna have soul nigers? Or maybe that's like calculated by region. That might be a possibility too. Like maybe Kanon tells you the amount in a region, and in that case, world map has soul nigers? I'm not sure what that means. Come on. How could you? Get blasted. Okay, the enemies here aren't weak like I thought they'd be. I thought they'd be weak because this is near Capo Bronco. Hey, level 37 for Greg. Just take a look around. Actually, yeah, I don't I don't want to skip encounters, so I'm just gonna like walk for a bit. I don't wanna end up too underleveled. Also, I need some lucky cards like ASAP. Let's look at the map. Let's take a good look around. Oh, is that? Oh, that's probably 12-bit. Let's take a little look-see. Let's take a good look around. At some point, I'll probably get a list of important treasures if I can, like coordinates, and I'll go out of my way to look for them. I'll probably do that at some point. Especially because it's a lot easier to get around with the mono wheel. Costumes. I hope we run into more costumes in this playthrough. I want more of those. Burst with blessings. Oh no. Was that Sam Regal doing the angel's voice? It hurt. It must be done. It must be done, you must die. It appears to be my turn. It is your turn. Bum. The angel will be better to kill. Oh, not insta kill. I'm in top shape now. Luckily, I have so many of these. Give me up. Treasure, nice. Avril's the goat. I suppose I should pick this up. Oh, the peppy acorn. I feel as if Sassy almost hardly ever give us problems before. in this game. But better to have them to not. Let's take a little look see. Let me just do a little gander here. Let's take a little look see. Let's take a good look around. Don't yeah, good look anything. around, just mindlessly spam the square button hoping Don't to find something. Let's take a little look see. Let's take a good look around. See anything? Searching. Ba -ba 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 -bum. Searching. Okay, we'll probably end up coming. Oh, hello. Oh, right, Treasure item. chest. Let's go. Fun. 10,000 Gela. Gela's really not a problem in this game, though. We're really gonna fly this time! Let's take a good look around. Don't miss anything. Stupid Don't miss anything. hills. There's so many Don't hills on Gaia. Someone better get on that. I'll see you later. Oh, welcome back, Flygon. So this is where Duo said we could learn about John the Appleseed. Yeah, we're finally getting close. Great, isn't it, Avril? Yeah, I suppose. That does not look like a happy face. This 
is mine. I've got so many duplicators, I don't need to worry about running out. The Laurel Crown, that does some kind of status prevention, I think. No, I was wrong. Doubles the HP recovery from items and skills. I do remember that one, though. That's the lowest defense. Rebecca. We can slap this on Rebecca. We don't need this Moonstone anymore. Int. We finally reached 12-bit. The town duo told us about. There's more people smiling here than there were in other towns, but I wonder how things really are. I guess the first thing to do is look around for information about Johnny Appleseed, like duo said. Your girlfriend there is pretty hot. Love that braid. What? I don't want to be here anymore. All right, first thing we do, look for Wild Arms cameos. Oh, thanks for the four duplicators. Not like I needed those. Lilka? Little sorceress with an umbrella. Gee. She looks almost, well, she looks like Lilka, but the umbrella is like a dead giveaway. Hello there, is your business in a pinch? Need a delivery in an instant? Then talk to me. No job is too big, no job is too small. I'm no good at selling myself. Basically, I've gotten into business on my own using my teleport orb. Yeah, Loka, you're not the best at teleporting. I'm just going to tell you. To tell the truth, I'm not all that good at this kind of magic yet, but I'm trying my best. You can't achieve anything unless you give it a shot after all. How nice. Good old Loka. He's so small and huggable. He was hungry. We had to leave the room. Oh, babies are so cute. I know the feeling. My little cousin's like five or something, and I remember the day he was born. It's been 60 years since Granny moved here, right from the time this town was founded. In fact, nobody knows more about 12 but than old Granny, you know. Once upon a time, I hear they'd take these girls from out of town to serve the Varuni. I wouldn't even give them any sort of proper food. There's a fair apprentice system now, though, and the girls are being decently treated. It's all thanks to Lady D Diana's kindness. Some of these young ladies even talk right out loud about how they'll never go back to these miserable lives they had before. Alright, Loka, I'll see you in a bit. Is this anyone? I feel them. I feel them. 12 is teeming with the spirits of the deceased. A little boy's spirit eyeing the bread right next to me. A poor drifter's soul at the spring before the clock tower whispering a little more, just a little more. Behind the young baker, a woman braided in braids carrying a ladle in their hands. Is Ashley gonna be here? By the way, Ladle reminded me of Lilith from Tales of Destiny. Ashley's gotta be here. Bakery's gotta be Ashley. Like, Ashley and Marina own a friggin' bakery. I'm looking for Ashley. That looks like a bakery. Oh, and that's a, um, that's a sparkle? I don't know how I'm supposed to get that, though. Hi, do I know you? The rising screenwriter? Ever since I was little, I've never known much about working with machines, but nobody on Phil Guy can match my skills at writing for stage and screen. What's more, I'm good looking and my style gets perfect marks. Was she born with it or was it? <sighs> Just kidding. But lately I've been feeling a touch of writer's block. I wonder what I have to do to shake this off. You look like Emma from Wild Arms 1, but I don't know if that's supposed to be Emma. The green hair reminds me of Emma. You're no one. 